Hello, hello, hello. Can you hear me now? Hi. Hello. Hi, teacher. Yes. Hi, teacher. Hello. Oh, I can hello, hear you. Teacher. Hi, everyone. So nice to see you again. I'm sorry, I was having uh, issues with my audio, but I'm so happy that you can hear me. I can hear you. So super good. Today is Friday. How are you? How's everything? Danita, thank you. thank you so much. Tired. No, come on. Today is Friday and the body knows it. <laughs> El cuerpo lo sabe, people say. All right. So thanks everybody for being here. Uh, are you resting tomorrow? Van a descansar mañana? Are you resting? No. no. Yes. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. And Sunday? Uh, Sunday is Dori? Yes. Sunday, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Milagro, what about you? Are you resting? Are you sleeping tomorrow? Oh, yes. Okay, nice, yes. nice. So take advantage. <laughs> yeah, duerma hasta tarde, if you can. <laughs> That's Costa. super good, yes. Dianita, are you resting tomorrow? Mañana descansa. Are you resting tomorrow? No. And Sunday? What about Sunday? Yes. Okay, yeah. Thank you. Thank you so, so much. Y Diana que está en su trabajo, que la veo con el... Yes. Thank you so much. You know, está haciendo el, el, el esfuerzo de estar desde el hospital, right, Diana? So, ah. you know, yeah, that's awesome. So, super, super, eh, you know, buen compromiso. That's super, super awesome. Increíble. Va a valer la pena, yeah. It will be worth it. Es verdad sí. It will be worth it. No, you know, y eso es el tipo de sacrificios que al final eh, decimos, valió la pena todo lo que hice, you know, I made it, I'm bilingual, so, eh, y lo, lo apreciamos mucho más, right, so, thanks everybody, gracias por estar acá, it is super, super cool to have you, eh, today vamos a completar, vamos a revisar, we are going to review part of eh, the, um, the topics, okay, of unit number two, para que también salgamos super bien en el examen. Por ahí algunos ya me lo mandaron. Super nice. Yo sé que hay un ejercicio que les está dando un poquito de dolor de cabeza. But para hacerlo más sencillo, hagamos lo siguiente. Copien el don't, copien el doesn't y lo pegan y asunto resuelto. All right. So eso es todo. Porque es por la comita que algunos les está dando incorrecto. No es que el ejercicio esté malo. All right. So, Teacher. Copien y pegan. No tell me, milagro. Yo ya pude. Gracias a Dios. Sí. Yes, ¿cómo le fue? Good. Ya, ya, ya lo envié ya. Super, super, super. Solamente no se nos olvide que son cinco partes, right? Entonces terminamos. Pero a mí solo me salieron cuatro. Eh, cuatro bye. partes. Cuatro, teacher. No oh, recuerdo haber visto cinco. Vaya, ok, déjenme revisar y si no yo les escribo en un ratito y les digo Por terminado favor. o me falta. Ok, no problem. Okay. Igual yo ya lo reviso. Pero gracias, ¿cómo les fue? Was it good? Very good. 80%, 90%, 100%. 100%. 100, yes, yes. 
Okay, super, super good. Lo pueden hacer cuantas veces sea necesario, right? To get it. Okie dokie. Okay, everybody, let's comparto. I'm sharing my screen so we can start practicing today. And um, this is session number 10. Increíble, terminamos las primeras dos semanas, all right? Ya casi se nos va el módulo también, you know? And uh, y hemos avanzado bastante, so that's the most important thing. Yesterday, estuve escuchando por ahí la parte de Simple Present, Routines, y a todos nos escuché bien, bien seguros, you know, so, con mucha fluidez, intentando decirlo sin leer, así que muy buen trabajo. You're doing it awesome, guys. So, you are rocking it. So, super, super good. Um, today is August the 14th, okay? And uh, we are going to practice vocabulary related to daily activities. So, we will practice Simple Present, to talk about daily activities, at work activities, etc., etc., third person activities also. Um, so just my my reminders, okay? <laughs> like your camera, but I see you and you're beautiful and you took a shower today, so <laughs> that's super nice, thank you. And homework, okay? So el examen que ya me lo enviaron, right? Así que thank you. Eh, también las tareitas, si a alguien me le falta alguna tarea, termínale, me da please complete it, así mañana yo le puedo enviar y le digo, uh, you got 100%, y estamos super bien, right? Um, so, part of the things that we are going to be doing today is uh, checking vocabulary. So, we are going to be checking some uh, activities, okay, that we do every single day. Here, tenemos nuevo vocabulario. We see kind of new vocabulary. So, we will repeat. Only we will practice listening. So, listen and repeat. So, everybody, activate your microphone, please. Si pueden, you know, activate your microphone. You can use earphones para que sea un poco más eh, fácil de escuchar for you and for us. And uh, para saber que lo estamos haciendo correctamente, right? So let's repeat. Come. 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 So I comb my hair, right? Next. I comb my hair. Yes. I go to school. I comb my hair. I go, go to, to school. school. I go to school. Arrive to school. I arrive, arrive to school. school. Okay. So arrive. What is the meaning of arrive? What is arrive? arrive. Arrive. arrive, arrive. Ah, yes. Llegar. Llegar, exactly. I arrive to school. I arrive to my house. So, arrive, okay? Arrive. Next. Live. Live the school. Live, live the school. school. What's the live. meaning of live? What is live? Irse. Yes, exactly. So, live the school. Live the so, school. I finish, I finish working. I leave my office, okay? So leave, I leave the school, okay? I leave my house, right? Next one, clean. 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 Yes, yes, clean. Okay, next, study. 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 Yes, very good. Next. Go shopping. Go, go shopping. shopping. Do you go shopping? Do you go shopping? Uh -huh. Do you go shopping? Yes. Do you go shopping? Yes. Do you like it? Do you like to go shopping? Yes or no? Yes. Yes. I, I like shopping. You like it. Okay. Okay. So, um, I like to go window shopping. So window shopping is the three minutes, right? <laughs> so I like to go window, window shopping. That's another one. Next, cook. Cook. Do you do you cook? Do yes. you? Yes. No, I don't. Yes. yes, I cook. Yes. Okay. Can you cook? Pueden? Can you cook? <laughs> yes, I can. So so. <laughs> yes. Okay, okay, all right. So who said no? Who does not cook? I heard someone said no. Wendy, do you cook? Hi, Wendy. Hi, 
Hi. Hi. Do you cook? Do you cook? Yes, I do. Ah, okay. <laughs> and, and she is like, yes. <laughs> okay, okay. That's all right. Thank you, Wendy. Next one. Wash the dishes. Wash the dishes. Wash the dishes. Wash the dishes. Mm -hmm. Wash the dishes. Yes. So wash, right? Next. Make a nap. Make, Make a, a, nap. A, nap. a nap. I will change it. Take a nap. Take a nap. Take a nap. What is take a nap? Take a nap. Tomar una siesta. Yes, exactly. So I don't take a nap. Do you take a nap? Do you take a nap? No. Like 10 minutes. Puedo decir make y take. Yes, but recomendaría take. Take is better. Aunque acá parece make, right? So, do you? Do you take a nap? Like 10 no. minutes, 20 minutes, that you sleep, no? Not take Nobody? You, okay, you don't take a nap. Nobody takes a nap. Let me see. Christian, do you take a nap? Do you take a nap for 10 minutes? 20 I minutes? Don't know. I don't know. No, I don't. No? Take a nap is like tomarse una siesta. Do you take a nap? No. no. No, I don't. Okay, no, you don't. No, I don't either. Okay, next, let's repeat. Walk the dog. Walk, Walk the dog. The dog. Walk the dog. Walk the dog. Walk the dog. Walk the dog. Very good, Walk. exactly. Walk the dog. Do you walk? Well, first, do you have a dog? No. No, yes. I don't. You don't? No? no. Nobody? Yes, I do. Who said yes? Sandra, yes. Yes, I do. Okay, okay. Sandra has a dog. Okay. Yes. One dog. One dog. All right. Who has a dog? Do you have a dog? Yes, I have. Okay, so Sylvia and Sandra, they have a dog. Do you walk your dog? Do you walk your dog? No. No. You don't. Do you walk? Sale como pasearlo, right? Do you walk the dog? No? No, it's dance. Yes, every day. Every day. Okay. So you do it every day. Sylvia, you don't. No. Okay. That's okay. That's all right. Next. Walk. Walk. Do you walk? Yes. No. Yes. Yes, I walk. A little or a lot? Little. A little. little a little. Okay. Mm. A little. Uh, I walk from my house to the street. <laughs> <laughs> and that's it. So not too much. Not too much. Next. Read the newspaper. Read, read the, the newspaper. newspaper. Do you read the newspaper? No, yes, I don't. No. no, nobody. Do you read eh, El Diario de Hoy? Do you read La Prensa oh, Gráfica? No. Michero? No? No. Año de no comprar eso. Yeah, I know, I know. I, I read, but los, los, eh, how do you call it? Los, los cartoons, los dibujitos que salían. That's it. <laughs> so los comics, that's it. Uh, no more, okay. Next, do you watch, okay, watch TV? Watch, watch TV. Watch TV. Watch TV. And the last, watch. store the internet. Store. Store the, the internet. Do you store? store. Yes, always. Yes. Yes. Sort is like, oh, usar la internet. It. So, sort. I store the internet. It's like, check the internet. If you use your cell phone. Navegar. Yes, the computer. You surf the internet. So, surf es la palabra para decir navegar en internet, right? So, we surf the internet. Okay, from oh, these no, no, no. activities, from these activities, what are the activities that you do? Like, every day, or from time to time, but activities that you do. And the activities that you like. For example, clean, do you like to clean? clean. No, I don't like clean. <laughs> Do you like to clean? No. 
Nobody. Okay. Yes, right. I do. Oh, yes. you do. What about taking a nap? Do you like to take a nap? Oh, yes. No, I don't. No. No? No, no. I don't like. No, I don't. No, I don't. No, I don't. You don't like it. Okay. Do you like to go shopping? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but I don't have money. Oh, uh, that's important. I like to go shopping, but as Madeline says, I don't have money. Okay. Only on, no, and now with the quarantine, no se puede, we cannot do it, okay. In so, the marketplace. In the, oh, on internet, okay. <laughs> do Oh, that's important. Do you shop on the web? Do you buy things on internet? Like yes. marketplace, yes. yes? The marketplace, or like it. Oh, yes, that's another. Do you, do you buy <laughs> things on internet? Online? Yes. No, yes. Okay. Online. Hey, hey, Harrison. I, hey, yeah, hello. I, I know your voice now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you check the internet. <laughs> no, you know, I recognize the voice because I don't have the, the picture. So I'm like, okay, that's ah, okay. For her voice. Presence teacher. <laughs> <laughs> no, thank you. Yeah. Okay. Okay, very good. New vocabulary? Did you find new vocabulary or are we okay? Are we okay? We are okay? Or do you yeah, have questions? Okay, let me know. Let me know if you have questions, please. So we can move to the next exercise. Okay, I will accept silence as no questions. <laughs> Please stop me if you have questions. Okay, take a look at these activities. It says, what do you do every day? We are going to start on Monday, the first day of the week. So the person says, on Monday, I, and look at the pictures, look at these pictures. So they represent something. So what does this person do on Monday? I will give you two minutes and I want you to write the activities that you believe the pictures represent. For example, on Monday, I, what do you think? Look at the picture. On Monday, I? Bing. I clean. I clean. Okay, I clean. That's okay. That's okay. Another idea. Picture. Uh, can, can, can you see the pictures? Logran verles. Can you see the pictures? Or some with the Yes. 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 Yeah, you can see them. Okay, okay, okay. So on Monday, I clean. You said that's okay. On Monday, I, like a teacher, como que le enseña. Yes. Well, se ve como que tiene un trapeador. Ah, mm -hmm. como un trapeador. Okay. Any, I, okay, I got a question for you guys. ¿Cómo se dice trapear? How do you say trapear? Internet, internet, dictionary, dictionary. How do you say trapear? How do you say trapear? Trapear. I will Mop. give you. Mop. Yes, excellent, exactly. Mob, yes. So, uh, oh, let's mostrar el otro. Okay. <laughs> so, on Monday, I mop. Yo trapeo. Exactly. On Monday, I mop. Do you mop? Do you mop your house? No. Okay. Mop. Yes. Yes, yes, I do. Yes, okay. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Okay. So, uh, what about number one? Number one is, has a broom. Can you call it? What is the action? Pero es una escoba la que tiene la primera figurita. Yes, la primera es una escoba. How do you say barrer? Barrer, entonces. Yes, how do you say barrer? Es sweep. 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 On Monday, I sweep the floor. Exactly, mm. I sweep, yo barro. Do you sweep your floor? Do you sweep? Sweep the floor. Yes? No? Yes. 
So sweep, yes. oh, barrer. Okay, sweep. Let's sweep. Yes, okay. sweep. On Tuesday, I... How do you say trapear? One more time. Mop. Yes. Mop On Tuesday, I mop the floor. Yes. On Wednesday. Wednesday. Next day. On Wednesday, I... Mapear. Jessica, can you repeat? Mapear. Mapear, teacher. Mapear. ¿Y qué hace el mm -hmm. niño? Limpiar. El niño está limpiando la mesa. Ah, limpiar. limpiar. Uh -huh. Clean the table. Clean the table. Clean uh -huh. the table. Clean the table. Ok, ok, that word. ¿Han escuchado wiper alguna vez? Have you heard wipe? Wipes. Wipes. Uh -huh. Yes. Wipes. So, on Wednesday, no es exactamente la palabra, all right, this, but I, I wipe. wipe. Ok, the table. Wipe. Es una forma de decir limpiar, all right? I wipe, wipe. the table. And on Thursday, I... Clean. Uh, the... Uh, clean the window? Yes, very good. I clean the window. Yes, excellent, exactly. So on Thursday, I clean the window. Super good. Are we okay here? Remember, tomemos nota de new vocabulary para que ustedes vayan ampliando el suyo, right? So you can get more vocabulary. No da tiempito de copiar porque tengo yes. que copiar en el cuadernito. Okay. I can wait for you. No worries. I can wait for you. ¿Quién es de apellido Vázquez? Who is Vázquez? Okay, everybody, so let's repeat. Sweep. 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 Mop. 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 Wipe. 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 Clean. 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 Super. Super good. Okay, very nice. Now let's go for more vocabulary. Okay, so here we have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Now let's go for Friday. On Friday, I, give me just a second, I'm going to mute you just to listen to your some opinions, okay? So on Friday, I, what do you think? Make the pair. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Let's let's take a look on Friday. Yes, very good. I make the bed. Okay, so I make the bed. Do you make your bed every day in the morning? Yes. Yes, you do. Yes, I do. Yes, you do. Isela, do you no. make your bed? No, I don't. <laughs> Beatriz, no. Okay. So Sandra says no. She does. <laughs> no. Okay. No. No, you don't. Okay. I made my bed on Saturday and Sunday. During the week, I don't. <laughs> I wake up super crazy. Okay. So, and super fast. Okay. Next. Saturday. On Saturday, I... Wash the dishes. 
Okay, excellent. Okay. I'm sorry, I wash the dishes. Do you wash your dishes every day? Only Saturday and Sunday. On, only Saturday and Sunday. Yes. Okay. So, okay. So, Sandra does every day. Nice, nice. Super nice. Next one. Let's take a look every at next. Oh, what is this action? What is this action? He has water and he has flowers. So, he... How do you say regar? Wait or the garden? Super good. Okay, so on Sunday, I water the garden. I water the plants. Yes, excellent. Very good. Exactly. So that is water. Do you water? Do you have plants? Do you have flowers? Yes. Yes. Okay, good. Good, good. Do you water your plants? Do you water? No. No, I don't. No, I don't. La lluvia la riega. That's a la buena de Dios, right? Uh -huh. No. <laughs> okay. So, uh, yeah, I, I water my plants, but like every three or four days. Cada tres o cuatro días. So I don't water my plants every day. Okay. Now... So let's let's take a look. This is part of the of the activities. All right. So I'm just showing you some of the activities that this person does. Okay. And uh, here we have uh, just a couple more. Okay. And I need your help with these exercises because Teacher. maybe yes. Teacher. Yes. Yo quería copiar la la anterior. Okay. This yes, one. Porfa, okay. Gracias. Yes. Yes. Of course. Let me know when you when you finish. I will give you some seconds so you can finish taking notes. Finish. Thank you. Thank you very much for the confirmation. Very good. Now, this is going. I have music. So, okay. So, now let's take a look at some, well, some activities, let's say, that you do. What I want you to do is something similar, okay? I want you to write a similar description. What is, oh, wait. I want you to write a similar description for your week. From Monday to Sunday, one activity that you do that specific day. For example, on Monday, every Monday, all right, every Monday, I drive. So, me toca conducir. On Monday, I drive. So, es exclusivo de lunes, right? On Tuesday, los Tuesdays, es de mi ropa, me toca lavar toda la ropa. So, on Tuesday, I wash my clothes, all right? Something very specific of that day. On Wednesday, so los miércoles, uh, what do I do on Wednesday? On Wednesday, I clean my house, all right? So, I clean, I sweep. And I mop, okay? On Thursday, Thursday, I normally I cook. I don't cook during the week, but on Thursday, I cook. 
on Friday. So Friday is my day off. Today morning eh, fue mi día eh, libre en la mañana, so I didn't work. So on Friday, I go shopping. I buy my groceries, I buy food. So that's it. On Saturday, tomorrow, no voy a trabajar. Así que tomorrow. Nos bañamos, teacher. On Saturday, no, but eso es de todos los días, mi ley. <laughs> <laughs> but on Saturday, veo televisión. I watch my favorite series. Okay, so tomorrow voy a ver televisión all day long. And on Sunday, so on Sunday, sí trabajo. On Sunday, I work. And that's it. Okay, so vamos a, a pensar en una actividad exclusiva de ese día. An activity that you do that specific day, all right? It, write it down, escríbanla, buscamos el vocabulario, look for the vocabulary, and uh, ya las vamos a compartir. We will share them in a second. So, for example, on Monday I take a shower, significa que solo el lunes se baña, right? So, no, <laughs> think about uh, an activity that is exclusive for that day. For example, some guys tienen reuniones los lunes, como ya está así, right? Entonces, on Monday, I have meetings all day long, right? Or on Monday, I have meeting with my boss, for example. So, piensen en una actividad exclusiva de ese día. Think about it. I will give you some minutes. And uh, if you have questions, please tell me, or questions with vocabulary, so please tell me. To make it easier, you can follow this example, right? So on Monday, on Tuesday, on Wednesday. So you can follow the example. Teacher. Yes, Yasira. Tiene que ser justamente solo de ahora. No, no, no. Um, what do you mean? ¿A qué se refiere? De domingo. Lo de, lo, de la oración que vamos a formar ahora. Ah, ok. No, no, no. It's for every day. Ok, let me, let me, let me go back. Let me, show, let me show you. It's one activity for every day of the week. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So one activity, mm -hmm. exclusive activity for Monday. On Monday, I... And the activity, yeah. Okay. On Tuesday, I and the activity. Today mm -hmm. is Friday, so también vamos a agregarle algo que hace exclusiva de este día. Or, o una general, si no se le ocurre nada, make it una, general. Una general. Mm -hmm. It's okay, okay. it's okay. General. Thank you, teacher. Yeah, yeah you're welcome.
Please uh, give me verbal confirmation when you finish. Tell me, teacher, finish, done, just to know. Oh, yeah. It's okay. I will give you some more minutes. Thank you, Sandra, for the confirmation. Wendy, thank you. Isela, thank you. Thank you for the confirmation. I will give you one more minute. Thank you, Patty. Hey, I'm so happy to see you, Carolina. Thank you. Is your internet better? Yes, a lot of glitter. Yes. Okay. Super, super good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Doris. Thank you, Doris. I finish. Okay. Thank you. Finish it. Yes. Awesome. Thank you very much. Okay, everybody. So now listen. We are going to practice this vocabulary. So we are going to go to a small groups and practice with your classmates. So you will tell them your everyday activities. Um, if it is possible, try not to, not to read, okay? If it is possible, say it, just say it, okay? And try to, to remember what you wrote. So give me just a second. I'm going to create the groups right now, all right? I have 17, oh, I'm missing three, okay. So, oh, 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 two, three, okay, there we go. So I'm going to, I'm going to send you the invitations. I'm going to send you the invite now. So you will see it popping, please accept it. Go and practice with your classmates. Go and practice with them. Isaac, thank you. Okay, okay, okay. A 
Okay, thank you guys. Thank you. Very good. Very good. So let's join the groups. Join the groups. So thank you, Doris. Thank you, Karen. Thank you, Diana. Thank you, Milagro. Milagro, are you there? Yes. Ya terminé. Ah, ok, super, super good. Milagro, ve algo popping. Ve como una nueva pantalla que le invita a unirse a un grupo. Yes. Oh, oh, sí. Ah, ok, ok, super, super good. Please, para que vayamos a practicar también con los compañeros, right? Thank you, thank you very much. Hello, good evening. Hi, Francisco. How are you? Welcome. Hi, hi. Awesome, awesome. Very nice. Hey, I can hear you better. Yes, yes. Ah, yes, I can hear you better now. Okay, thank you. Uh, you don't see your classmates because they are practicing. So I am going to, let me show you, let me show you before you go. Because, okay. So before, estuvimos practicando esto. We were practicing daily activities, okay? And your classmates hicieron esto. So they wrote their activities, okay? Lo que hacen como una exclusiva de cada un día de la semana. For example, on Monday, on Tuesday, on Wednesday, okay. etc. Pero like, on Monday, I sweep the floor, porque solo ese día lo hace, right? Etc. Mm -hmm. So eso es lo que vamos a hacer, compartir una actividad ¿Qué hacemos? Yes, um, during the week. De hecho, la idea es también practicar nuevo vocabulario. Por ejemplo, here está sweep the floor, barrer, right? Barrer, uh -huh. We have mop, this picture, mm -hmm. trapear, like, right? Trapear. Oh, okay. Yes, then we have wipe, que es como limpiar algo, right? So wipe the table. Entonces también usamos como nuevo vocabulario. So that is also the idea. Clean the table, make the bed. Wash the dishes and also water the plant. Reconoce el vocabulario. Do you recognize this? Solo las primeras tres son las que conocía, barrer y trapear. Ahí se las muestro si gusta tomar picture o quiere anotarlo. So you can. Ah, ok. Super, super, super good. Ok, nice. So, es lo que vamos a hacer. Eh, le, voy a le voy a mandar la invitación. I'm going to send you the invitation para que podamos escuchar y podamos practicar. Así que gracias por unirse. Thank you very much. Ya me parecía raro que no lo veía por acá y usted está bien puntual. No, le mandé un, un mensajito temprano. Ah, sí, es cierto, es cierto, que tenía reunión, ¿verdad? Sí, no, no, no se preocupe. Siempre que tenga dificultades, acá estamos hasta la vieja, así que usted puede unirse. Thank you very much. Gracias por tomarse la, el tiempo, right? Ahí está la invitación, so you can join it. Ok, gracias. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Ella está enojada. Ajá, entonces es como, eh, is she envy? Eh, entonces Ay, eso me ayudó para que el cerebro empezara a pensar en inglés. Ahí está, mira, ahí se la decirle cómo era lo que estaba diciendo. ¿De qué? ¿De qué? ¿De ¿De qué? ¿Qué, ¿Qué vas a hacer? Decir. ¿Qué, qué haces? No lo que pasa es que solo puedo pensar en español, no pienso en inglés, entonces voy a retirar inglés esta semana. Voy a es estar. que está la duda existencial no. que dice, no. en martes yo hago reportes de mi oficina. Ajá. Ok. Entonces, es como, I make Ajá. reporting from the office. office. reports. Ambas están bien. Hay varias formas de decirlo, right? No es como que solo hay una forma. Entonces, no worries. Eh, la que Chris ha mencionado, I make office reports, está súper bien. Pero también la que se le mencionó, I make reports, está bien. Entonces, ambas está bien. I make reports, sin el ING. Mm -hmm. Está súper bien. That's súper good. 
Cuénteme, cuénteme, ¿cómo es eso? How is that? <risa> no, no, guys, no, guys. Los, los quiero ver terminando, así que los quiero ver bilingües, you know. When you are in level 20 and you tell me, hey, teacher, I made it, I'm bilingual. No me gustaba, me la pude. Yo tengo una pregunta y el segundo y el tercero y el cuarto módulo siempre vamos a hacer este grupo, entonces, o eh, siempre rota. Por lo general tenemos rotación, pero las inscripciones les van a hacer llegar alrededor de la próxima semana porque no son automáticas. Usted se tiene que inscribir nuevamente, right? Entonces, le mandan... No lo hace el, con la empresa, no lo hace Sí, sí, lo hace su empresa, como lo hizo la primera vez, que Recursos ah. Humanos envía la documentación y usted se inscribe. Pero a lo que me refiero con automático es que no se inscribe en el 1 y ya está registrado hasta el 20, ah, sino okay. que mes a mes usted va haciendo el registro. Uh -huh. ah, okay. Porque como depende también de las notas, ¿right? Y, mm. por eso, y de la asistencia, entonces por eso es que estamos ahí. Venga, practique. You know? Because es bien importante. So, y eso si es no super... alcanza el final del módulo, si no alcanza el, el 80%, lo vuelve a repetir o lastimosamente va para afuera. Estas son becas. The, they are scholarships. Entonces es como de cuidarlas, ¿verdad? Porque Insafor eh, nos da, el, nos, les da la, la oportunidad de tomarlo solo una vez. Entonces, oh, okay. eh, es bien importante que al tener una beca así, ya que es totalmente... Eh, Gratis. Ajá, exacto, totalmente gratis por Insafor. Usted va a estar gratis hasta el nivel número 18, right? Entonces, eh, que, que la cuidamos y que uh -huh. si en algún momento usted se registra y le diga, no, no quiere seguir, perdón, le diga sus recursos humanos. Pero aprovechenla, chicos, y un módulo vale pero 90 si digamos, dólares. Pero si digamos me retiro, me retiro, me pueden dar oportunidad más adelante. Eh, puede ser como Uy, una ¿cómo? pausa. No, tendría que ser una Ajá, pausa. una pausa por algo. Una por pausa, algo, ah, por, pero, algo. pero porque lo aprobé, vea. Por eso, uh -huh, obviamente, pero, tengo pero que aprobarlo. No, pero no en medio, exacto. No puede dejar como, Ajá, no ah, puedo ya salir, no quiero. Nada más. No, Ajá, no, Ajá. Y, y tampoco la, in, la intención, Ajá. ¿verdad? La cuestión es rebuscarse y, y aprovechar al máximo esa oportunidad. Bye, chicos. Ese fue el commercial. Eso. Okay. okay, now tell me. I want to okay, listen to you guys. Oh, Isela, what do you do on Wednesday? Wednesday, I do the shopping. Okay. Supermarket. Okay, very good. Okay. On Thursday? On Thursday, I go to the, my, my grandmother's house. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. On Friday, I drink a wine. <laughs> so today. <laughs> yes, después de la clase. <laughs> or, or, or before the class. <laughs> After the class. Uh -huh. the class. To, re to relax. <laughs> yes. Uh, that's okay. That's all right. Okay. Guys, what about Saturday? What do you do on Saturday? Saturday, I do homework. You do homework? Okay. Christian, what do you do on Saturday? I bathe my pet oh okay so you you wash you bathe okay yes. very good nice what do you have cats or dogs uh dog okay okay gabby what about you gabriela what do you do on saturday uh, on saturday i like to go to the beauty salon nice so tomorrow are you going to the beauty salon what yes. is, what are you getting nails hair no, i cut my hair tomorrow Ah, okay. But cutting like a little or like a lot? No, a lot. Me lo voy a cortar hasta aquí. How, <laughs> how, how long? How long is you? Because my hair is short. How oh. long is your hair? Uh, ¿Cómo se dice lengua en inglés? Uh, what? <laughs> lengua. Lengua, de lengua. Uh -huh. <laughs> tongue. Ah, tongue. Uh -huh. El tongue, córtase. <laughs> No, mi pelo no, es super no. largo. O sea, lo tengo ya bien largo. No sé. so, and, and, and you're going to cut up to here, up to your yes. shoulders. Yes. Like, like this. Like, mm. Okay. But you can donate. You can donate your hair. So oh. you, you, can, you can make it longer and you can mm. donate para los, los niños de cáncer, mm -hmm. los niños que tienen cáncer, right? That would be super cool. Se lo yes. puede cortar hasta acá. Ajá, you know? uh -huh, yes. <laughs> Okay, not too much. <laughs> okay, guys, very nice. Hey, that, that's very good. And very good pronunciation, by the way. I, I really like it. I think it's super cool. 
Okay, so keep practicing. Let me let me go for the other groups. And in two minutes, we will return. In two minutes, okay. we will go back. Hello, hello. Hi, everyone. How are you? Oh, Why are you so quiet? <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong? <laughs> Did you finish? I'm I'm I am tired. Oh, you're, yeah, I know. Today is like difficult, but it's the last day of classes. Tomorrow, are you working? No. Do no. you work? No. Yes. No. Oh, okay. Yes. So Francisco work. is working. Wendy, no. Are you working tomorrow? Va a trabajar. Are you working? No, le estoy de vacaciones. Okay, super good. No, that's even better. So you can sleep all day long. <laughs> okay, <laughs> nice, nice. So tell me, guys, tomorrow, Saturday, what do you do on Saturday? Yo, I go. Está bien, Wendy. I cook mañana. Okay, okay, so you cook, but you are on vacation. So what do you do on vacation? Cook. <laughs> okay, what do you do on vacation? Uh -huh. Tell me, tell me. Um, I am on Saturday, I wash my car. Ah, okay. But do you wash your car? No. Or you go to the, to the car wash? See. Si. Yes, I okay. go to the wash a uh, car wash. Okay, okay. Yeah, I imagine you washing your car. <laughs> okay, that's okay. All right, nice. So, Francisco, what do you do on Saturday? Uh, on Saturday, I wash my clothes. Okay, very good. Do you wash, yes. like my wash? Clothes. Or in the in the machine, in the washing machine, or by hand? No. By hand? By hand. Okay. By hand. Okay. That's okay. That's nice. It's more difficult, right? <laughs> okay. Okay, guys. Very good. That's okay. You know, something I like is que podemos, no sé si ya se dieron cuenta, pero podemos hablar en inglés, you know? We can talk in English. No es necesario utilizar español. And you get it. So, lo entiende. So very nice job. Estamos super bien con listening. We are doing a nice job with listening, guys. Super cool. I like it. Thank you. Okay, uh, vamos a la principal. Let's go back to the main station, please. Welcome back, everybody. I am missing some. I am still missing some guys here. All right. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you for coming back. Thank you, guys. Look, le comentaba hace unos segunditos a un grupo, you know, because it called my attention. Estamos, les estaba preguntando en inglés, you know, y me respondieron todo en inglés. So I was like, super cool, porque entienden, you know, el, el listening, no sé si ya se percataron, pero su listening está mejorando. So your listening is getting better. Y escuchan algo and you're like, oh, ya entendí lo que me, me, entendí lo que me preguntó, right? So super nice. That's super, super good. Very nice job, guys. I think that you're doing a super good job. So we are going to continue and now with third person singular, porque creo que nos está dando como un poquito de dificultad, right? So let's take a look at maybe new vocabulary, okay, and also a pronouns. So let's take, okay, give me a second, okay. Let's take a look. Here you have a picture, the first picture, and we need a pronoun. ¿Qué hace falta? What is missing? He. He cleans the toilet. Okay, he cleans the toilet. Clean. Do, you, do you clean your toilet? Not really. Okay. Yes, I do. 
<laughs> yes, you do. Okay, so he cleans his toilet. Okay, I clean my toilet too. Okay, next. Rakes. Let's repeat, everybody. Rakes. 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 The leaves. Rakes. The leaves. Uh huh. He's raking, raking the leaves. Okay. Mm -hmm. He rakes the leaves. Next one. He or she. 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 Okay, she, she. so she does. Yeah. She does the furniture. Do you dust? Do you dust? Sacudir. Uh -huh, exactly, sacudir. Do you dust your furniture? The table. I dust my, my bed. <laughs> Only dust. <laughs> okay, so not me. Not make, but that's the, the bed. It's okay, it's fine, and it is also acceptable. Next one, ¿Quién me ayuda con la siguiente? Who helps me with next? Any idea? He, 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 he trash her. Okay, okay, it's related to the trash, yes. It's related to trash. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Give me a second. Okay, takes out the trash. Exactly. So take out, right? Takes pick out the, the trash. trash. No. Uh, can you repeat? Pick up the trash. Oh, that's a possibility too. No, what is the difference? Pick up is como levantar, you know, como recoger. Oh, okay. Yeah, oh, okay. pero también funciona. It works. And take out oh, is sacar la basura. Mm -hmm. ah, yeah. So. Depende de lo que quiera decir, right? So, I take out my, tra my trash on Monday. And you, do you take out your trash? Or my mother takes out the trash? Or my sister takes out the trash? Takes out the trash. Yes, on Wednesdays, I take out tra the trash. Exactly, very good, very nice. So remember, acá lleva la S porque es he, right? Pero si yo digo I, le puedo quitar la S. And it's okay. I take out the word. Thank you, Silvia. Super good. Okay. Teacher. Yes. Tell me, Madeline. Mm, yo tengo una pregunta. ¿Cómo dijo de que se escribía el verbo irse? Oh. Es que veo, veo the leaves en la segunda oración. Oh. No sé si yo copié mal el verbo irse o es, bien, o es similar. Eh, yes, Madeline, you're totally right. Leaves puede ser uh, las hojas, right? Pero leave también es el verbo de irse. For example, when I say I leave my house, I leave my house, yo me voy de mi casa, right? Or si es tercera persona, lo tengo que conjugar, sería she. Lips. Yes. Mm, yes. Hey, excellent. Her house. Super. I like it, guys. Okay. I leave my house. Mostrar, no te puede mostrar eso en la pantalla, por favor. Está en el chat. De hecho, se los, se los acabo de compartir en el chat oh. para que les quede guardadito. Mm -hmm. I leave my house. She leaves her house. Ella se va de su casa. ¿Cómo voy a saber entonces cuándo es una hoja? Because, give me a second because I hear a lot of uh, interference. Okay, so, eh, ¿cómo sé cuándo es hoja? Solo por el contexto. El contexto me dice si es el verbo irse o son hojas. For example, if I say, I pick up, I pick up some leaves, okay, so, Yo sé que no puedo recoger el verbo, right? So, es algo que recojo. Entonces, I pick up some leaves. Yo recojo las hojas, all right? But yes, so es, es de tener un poquito de cuidado. But you're totally right, Madeline. So, el verbo y las hojas es, se escribe de la misma forma, right? Y se pronuncia igual también, okay? That's a very nice observation. Thank you. ¿Estamos bien? Are we okay? O sea que siempre, por ejemplo, va con este tema de de estas dos palabras que se parecen pero que tienen diferente significado quiere decir que, ca que la oración que nosotros vayamos a hacer tiene que ser bien específica para poderlo identificar si es eh, yo barro las hojas o si mi mamá dejó mi casa por ejemplo 
Sí, de hecho, exactamente es eso, el contexto el que le dice, cuál es el significado de la palabra. Van a encontrar muchas palabras que se escriben igual, pero significan otra cosa. Entonces sabemos como por, por el contexto, por qué es lo que le está diciendo. For example, here, si usted ve, he rakes the leaves, o incluso cuando usted vea the, entonces ya sé que son las hojas. So, sí, es un, un objeto, right? So this is, es otra forma de identificarlo. The leaves, son las hojas. Los verbos no llevan dos, all right. So that is another way. That's super good. Um, eh, ¿Estamos bien, Madeline? Did I answer your question? Yes. Okay. Okay, okay. okay, everybody. So let's continue. Take a look at the following. It says uh, he or she. ¿Cuál que eh, hace falta? What is missing? Sí. Okay, so he washes. He washes the he, car. He washes the car. The car. Mm -hmm. Teacher, hay mucha interferencia. Yo creo que deberían de poner cuidado con eso, porque se oye muy fuerte. Alguien hay tiene por ahí. Hay un ahí que deberían de bajar. Yo yes, I know, I know. Porque eh, interfiere mucho. I know, por eso acá les estoy silenciando. I'm silent para escuchar exactamente como la respuesta, right? Pero sí les agradecería que... Eh, si pueden bajarle un poquito solamente al, um, a un televisor si tienen por ahí. Que creo que eso es lo que a veces nos interfiere. Or some music. All right. Thank you, guys. Um, okay. Take a look at the following. The next one. Se la voy a mostrar because it's new. Okay. So this is obviously he. And then we have set the table. Look at the picture and look at the bird. Set the table. What is the meaning of set the table? Como poner la mesa. Perfect, yes. So set the table is ponerla, right? When you say, please, poner la mesa. So please set the table. In this case, he set the table, all right? Uh, next one. Next one is new, but I need your help. What is she doing? What is the action? Look at the next. This is what you do with your clothes. How do you say that in English? Yes. Planchar. Planchar. Oh, iron the clothes. Yes. Iron. I don't know who said that, but yes, iron. Do you iron? Do you iron your clothes? I yes. No, I don't. Yes. No, I don't. Yes, I do. Yes, yes I do. Yes, I okay. Do. I Super. Do. So iron, that's iron, right? And the last one, the last one is dry. So dry. She dries the clothes, okay? Or simply dry, okay? <laughs> um, here, le agregamos IES, but I'm going to write it in the chat because this is new. So the verb is only dry. So dry, dries, porque es tercera persona, right? So you can say, I dry my clothes. What the meaning? Ah, look, look at colgar, the picture. No. Look at the picture. Tender la ropa. No, colgar la ropa. Not really. I dry my hair. I dry my hair. Secar. 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 Exactly, exactly. So dry is secar. Mm -hmm. I dry my hair. I dry my clothes. ¿Qué más secan? What do you dry? Uh, I dry... Yeah, dry. Uh, I dry the dishes. Okay, ah, uh, yes, yes, okay, I dry the dishes, exactly, exactly, that's a good I, example. I, I dry the bone, bone, herida, secar ah, una herida. Ah, the wound, yes, okay, okay, that's a good example as well. So, dry no es exactamente colgar, sino secar, right, the action of drying. So, the, the, the most common example is this, dry my hair, I dry my hair. Okay, guys, uh, give me just a quick second, because we are de, going to... Y el, ¿cómo se pronuncia? Sería como, he washes the car. Wash, esa, la, eh, el verbo, no, sí, el verbo, washes, eh, washes, o como. Yeah, yeah, that's the correct pronunciation, washes. Okay. So he washes the car, yes. Ah, okay. So, remember, acá lo, lo que único que hacemos es agregarle S. Esto sí le agregamos ES, right? He washes the car. Or she en washes. De, ¿Y cómo vamos? En el caso de, perdón, perdón, en el caso de que si yo quiero decir me, me quiero planchar el cabello o me plancho el cabello, se pronuncia siempre 
es eh, Iron o Iron, no sé cómo se dice. Um, Iron, 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 como Iron Man, recuerde Iron Man, yes. <risa> yes. So, teacher, ¿y cuándo vamos, a, eh, cuándo vamos a identificar cuando se le agrega la ES? Porque aquí oh. está Drys, el yes. Drys, el, 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 el verbo es Dry, pero en Wash, Wash es Wash, entonces, ¿cómo voy a saber cuándo agregarle el la IS? Porque puede hacer que solo podamos pensar Wash y la S al final. That's a very good question. That's a very good question. De hecho, todavía no hemos introducido el tema, All right, lo vamos a ver en las próximas unidades. Exactamente cuál es la regla para agregar S, E, S, I, E, S. Así que no worries. Por el momento, las únicas que hemos visto, algunas, you know, de las que hemos visto con E, S, son, for example, here, todas son S. Cleans, rakes, dust, takes. Only mm -hmm. S. And here, si tenemos washes. Wash. This is one. Sets, irons, and dries que son eh, washes and dries, son parte de los cambios. But no worries, ya lo vamos a ver. Ok, uh, guys, antes de continuar, before like moving on, let me go over attendance, eh, because otherwise I will forget. So give me just a second. Solo me ayudan con la verbal confirmation, please, that you are here and you are participating. So just a second. I start with Chris again. <laughs> Christian, Christian. Thank you, Isaac. Isaac. I think I saw Isaac. Isaac, are you there? Ahí está. Sí, ahí está. Quizás no sí está, escucha. pero está en mudo. Ay, 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 parece que le quito. Thank you, Isaac. <laughs> Thank you. Edith. Christian. Thank you. Yasira. Present. Awesome. Thank you. Isela. Present. Thank you. Gaby. Present. Yes. Silvia. Silvia was there. Present. Oh, Present. Yes. Yes, you are. Francisco Enrique. Present. Thank you. Diana. Present. Yes, oh, yes. There you are. Thank you, Diana. Thank you so much for being here. Eh, Patricia Carolina. Present. Thank you, Patty. Sandra? Present. Thank you. Herson? Present. Thank you. Madeline Gabriela? Present. Thank you. Doris? Present. Thank you, always present, I know. Karen Cubillas? Present. Thank you, Karen. Maria Milagros? Present, teacher. Thank you, Milagro. Eh, Wendy Elizabeth? Present. Thank you, Veronica. Present. Thank you, Vero. Welcome, uh, Mr. Murcia. Present. Thank you, and Jeremias. I don't see Jeremias. Okay. It's all right. Thank you very. Ooh, casi casa llena. Solo nos falta uno. We are missing only Jeremias. That's super, super nice. Okay. Almost, almost we have a full house. Ok, everybody. So, antes de seguir y antes de practicar a little more third person, preguntas. Do you have any question? Question. Si nos recordamos que terceras personas le agregamos S, right? Yes. Ok, very nice. Yes. So, before moving on, before moving on, this is going to be the activity that you will be doing. Write the daily routine of a family member. So, Escojan a un miembro de su familia. Choose any family member. Your son, your daughter, your father, your mother, your husband, your wife, or your friend, okay? And I want you to write a short description of the daily activities, okay? He or she does. Remember, eso es bien importante. Practice makes perfect. Entre más practicamos, más fáciles, más fluidez agarramos, mejor vocabulario, mejor pronunciación. Así que, this is going to be your time to practice. Pongámosle negativos, pongámosle positivo, right? And everything you can. Agregamos el new vocabulary. Si no se sabe en la rutina, invéntenla, all right? So be creative, add more things. I will give you like 10 minutes y luego vamos a la practice, right? So nos quedamos acá. 
and just write it down. Take notes. Agreguemos conectores. Add connectors. Later, after that, first, second, etc., etc. And y no se nos olvide la S. Don't forget letter S porque es tercera persona, right? So my brother likes, my brother goes, my brother works, or my brother doesn't work. So positivos, negativos, and everything you can. Cuando lo tengan listo, let me know. I'll give you like five, ten minutes. Teacher. Que no oye, Yasira. No oye. No, porque tiene mute. Ay, hi, Yasira. Ah, ya le quito el mute. Teacher, este, una pregunta. Eh, sería como la actividad de que hace en el día, nuevamente, así como le hicimos hace un momento, pero eh, personal. Eh, yeah, but es como lo mismo, Yasira, pero ahora vamos uh -huh. a hacer un pequeño cambio. Porque ya no es su rutina, sino que ahora va a ser la rutina de un family member. Uh -huh. Entonces, escoja uh -huh. a un miembro de su familia o escoja a uh -huh. alguien conocido, right? Y no es eh, precisamente de lunes, martes, miércoles, sino puede ser un día y la, la rutina completa de ese día, right? Ah, ok. Por ejemplo, eh, I'm going to, digamos que le voy a hablar de mi hermana. Uh -huh. uh, her name is Milagro. She works in, in, a, in a laboratory. She is a psychologist. She wakes up. Vamos a agregarle S. So she wakes up early. Later, she listens to music. Sometimes she listens to reggaeton in the morning. Can you believe it? <laughs> and, and she wakes me up. Uh, she brushes her teeth mm -hmm. and she makes breakfast. Entonces, es como la rutina, right? Pero en tercera persona. Ya no la mía, sino de alguien más. Okay, teacher. Let's work okay, on it. Thank you. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Take his breakfast. ¿Cómo dice finish? ¿Cómo era finish? You can say finish. Finish, finish is okay. Or you can say done. Finish. Or done. Mm -hmm. Both are okay.
En tercera persona. Sweet. Sweet. De trapear. No. Cambia. Mm. No, trapear. Uh, trapear es. Y no trabarrer. Uh -huh. No, 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 no. The other way around. Wait, 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 wait. Mm. Give me a second. This one. Okay, so this one, mm. number one is I sweep. That's barrer. And number two oh. is on Monday I mop. So that's trapear. But uh, yes, let me show you. Let me show you. Give me a... Oh, okay, here, here, here. Look, look. You can see the third person uh, form. For example, on Monday, he sweeps. Only S. On Tuesday, he mops. So only S. Mm -hmm. okay, thank you. You're welcome. Do you need more time? ¿Cómo les está yendo? How are you doing there? Ya casi, almost there. One more minute, two more minutes. One hour. <laughs> so, are you almost there? Done. Okay, okay. Silvia, done, yes. I finished. Okay, thank you, very nice. Thank you, thank you very much. Finish. Thank you, thank you so much. Thank you, Doris. Thank you for the confirmation. So I'm going to, we are going to wait just one more minute and then we practice. One more minute is good, I think. Thank you guys for the confirmation. I see Doris, I see Sandra, eh, Francisco Murcia, Edith, Wendy, Milagro, Isela. Thank you very much. I heard Yasira before, and also I heard, I believe, Francisco. I'm not sure. ¿Qué me hace falta? Who is missing? Or is everybody ready? Gabriela, thank you very much. ¿Qué me hace falta? Who is missing, guys? Okay, Yasira, we are ready. Okay, okay. Okay, everybody. Hello? Hello? Milagro falta. No, I see Milagro is done already. Karen, okay, thank you, Karen. I also see Karen, thank you. Okay, everybody, so listen up. Vamos a irnos a grupos. We are going to go there one more time. Este es un resumen. Entonces, intentemos no leerlo, sino intentamos decirlo lo más natural que podamos, right? So, you can say this. Let me talk. Practicar this one, como una presentación chiquitita. Let me talk about my brother. Let me talk about my sister. Let me talk about my mother. 
y luego le pueden decir el nombre. So this is the one. Let me talk about. Everybody, let's repeat. Let me talk about. Let me talk about. Let me talk about. Let me talk about. Let me talk about my brother. Let me talk about my brother. Let me talk about my brother. So let me talk let me talk about, about my brother. About my brother. Let me talk about my brother. Let me talk about my brother. Exactly. So let me talk. Let me talk. That is something about my brother. About my brother. Okay. So that is, permítame hablarle de, permítame contarle de. So let me talk about. All right. So this is what we are going to be doing. Yes. Let me talk about. So let me talk about my sister. Um, let me talk about my son. Let me talk about my husband. And then you can say he wakes up, he cleans, etc. Okay. So, esa es una forma. This is a way to introduce this topic. So, everybody, les envío ahorita la invitación. I'm going to send you the invitation. Uy, uy, uy. Give me a second. Okay, let me just a sec. Where are you? Where are you? Into. Let me talk. Let me talk. Let, yes. Let, let, me talk. let me talk about my brother. Let's, let, let me talk. My son. Let me talk about. Okay. Hold on just a second. And uh, okay. okay, 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 everybody. There we go. So, give me just a second. I'm going to send you the invitations. No, actually, les voy a unir de una sola vez. I'm going to uh, send you to the groups. So, there we go. I believe it works. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. So let's join and let's practice. We will have 20 minutes y luego regresamos. So 10, 20 minutes. Okay. Then we will come back. Thank you. Thank you. Let's join it. Let's join it, everybody. Hi, Danita. Hello, girl. Yes. Uh, to be able to rest later. Okay. And the next, me. Let me talk about my daughter. Uh, her name is Nicole. Uh, my daughter wake up earlier in the morning uh, she received her class in the day she have her breakfast in the morning uh, before to uh, to get in the hair class at the end of the day she work out that's it that's all, come on. 
Yeah, you got it, girl. Super good job. Thank you, Carolina. That was nice. Okay, super good. Very nice description, very fluent, and very good vocabulary. You said your daughter works out. Workout. Uh huh. So your daughter works out. How how old is your daughter, Carolina? How what? old? How old is Cuántos your daughter? Años? Yes. Um, seventeen. Seventeen. Ah, okay. Okay. Ah, okay. I okay. I see. Okay. I see. Alright, but that was a good description. Okay. <laughs> All right. That was a good description, Carolina. Solo no se nos olvide la S, right? Don't forget letter S because it todo está bien estructurado, pero no le escuché la S. I didn't listen to the S at el final. Okay. Solo no agregamos la y lo demás super super nice. Okay. Lo demás está super bien. Okay, guys. So, sorry. <laughs> Next person. Okay, me. Let me talk about my brother. He wakes up after he rides a bicycle. Later, he eats breakfast and he watch TV. Then he plays video games. After he wash the clothes, after he is with the house, and he mops the floor, then he take a shower, and that's it. Guys, give some emojis to Silvio. <laughs> No tenemos aplausos, así que, you know, let's work with emojis. Uh, Silvia, that was nice. That was a very good description. Muy buen uso de terceras personas. So I heard S. And uh, good vocabulary. That was pretty good. Solamente repitamos watches. Watches. So he, he, he watches. Exactly. Lo demás, super good. That's good. Woo, Friday. <laughs> Hey, me, yes. Let me tell about my daughter. Uh, her name is Dana. She gets, gets up at 8 a.m. Watch her videos on YouTube on the, her tablet. Then, then have breakfast and take his vitamins. Then takes ten takes a shower. Nice, super good, Silvia. That was uh, Silvia. Oh, sorry, Sandra. <laughs> I'm confused. <laughs> that was very nice, Sandra. Uh, that was about your daughter. You said right. So we have yes. to talk about your daughter. That was a good description. Uh, Buena estructura, Sandra. That was pretty good. And, uh, and very good pronunciation. Super, super good. Hi, Sandra. The, the music <laughs> makes me feel like, oh, it's Friday. It's Friday. <laughs> <laughs> es mi sobrino. <laughs> but, pero se escucha que están, lo están disfrutando. Awesome. Super nice. Sí. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, teacher. You're welcome, guys. And the only boy. Francisco. Okay, guys. So continue practicing. Lo veo un segundito. And uh, agreguen más vocabulario. Try to add more. Agreguen negativos. No escuchen negativos todavía. Podemos agregar un par de actividades que ellos no hacen, right? Déjenme ver cómo están los demás. Solo, solo falta. Así yo y Nastasia. Silfu. Because he has a company. Okay. She prepares. Yes. Ella prepara de mariscos. Uh -huh. Hi there. Hi everyone. Uh -huh. Hi, how are you doing there? Oh, I love your pet, eh, Francisco. Is that a girl? 
Is that a girl or a boy? Road. Yeah, it's a girl. Mm, y luego, oh, so cute. It's a, a car. It's, a, a... it's really cute. What's the breed? <laughs> ¿Cuál es la raza? What's the breed? And then, it's, uh, luego, ella regresa. Regresa. She returned home to have. Déjeme pensar que no me recuerdo. <laughs> it's okay, no worries. But it's super cute. It's really, really cute. Okay, guys, ¿cómo les está yendo? How are you doing here? Are you finished? Are you almost yeah. ready? Vi por ahí a Gabriela practicando. Alonso. <laughs> <laughs> Did you finish already? ¿Ya terminaron? Sí, pero lo vamos a volver a practicar. Uh, okay, okay, so listen up, vamos a hacer lo siguiente. We are going to be doing the next thing. Los voy a mover. I'm going to send you ah, okay. to other groups para que practiquemos con otras personas e intentemos esta vez no leerlo, sino hacerlo como más, más natural, ¿verdad? Que nos salga y recordar el vocabulario también. No es de memorizarlo, sino solamente es de, de like, recordarse, right? So, No pudo, Isaac. Hello, hello, hello. Hi, everyone. Hi. I'm sorry. Los traje de una sola vez because vamos a volver a practicar. We are going to practice one more time, but para que practicamos con alguien más también, right? Because creo que hemos estado las dos horas con las mismas personas. So necesitamos... We need more time. I know, I know, I know, but no worries. Ahorita los envío nuevamente. I'm going to send you one more time. Okay, so just let me check. Déjenme verificar si están con las mismas. Edith, Madeline, and Silvia, ustedes estuvieron juntas, ¿no, verdad? No. Okay. Vaya, awesome. Doris, Gabriela, ustedes sí estuvieron juntas. You were together. Déjenme ver, let me just take a look para que practique, me practique con alguien más as well. Hold on, hold on. Eh, Doris, Edith, and Silvia. No, ustedes no estuvieron juntos. Ok, ok, everybody. So, los voy a enviar one more time. Remember, la idea es agarrar su, su, un poquito de fluidez ok, y pronunciación, entonces practiquemos practice, intenten no leerlo and let's go, let's join it let's have fun as well, so you have five more minutes so everybody please get in the groups let's join the groups Ok. okay. Eh, ¿Empiezo yo o sí, empiezo? Empiece, está bien. Ok. Let me, let me talk you about my mom, Maribel. His name, her name is Maribel. And first she makes, she makes early. She makes, she wakes up early. <laughs> Make, makes breakfast after that she walks in the park at 6 30 a.m and then she takes a shower later she listens to music next she washes novels and then she has lunch with my father and my brother and finally she takes a nap at 2 p.m. This it. Super, very nice job, Christian. Hey, yes, you got it. Good pronunciation, good fluency. I like it. Thank you very much. 
I'm surprised, Christian. You said your mother walks in the park every day? Yes, every she day. Walks. Uh, wow. Yes, every day. It's for, it's for his healthy. Uh -huh. I mean, yeah, but it's so awesome because I don't do it. <laughs> Guys, yes. do you do you walk? Do you walk? I I am I go to the gym ready. You go to the gym every day. super every day. Wow, super nice. Sandra, I mean Patrick Carolina, do you go to do you go to 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 the gym? Do you walk? Um, I like more uh, walk. Um, rápido, como fast. Walk fast. fast. Uh -huh. Ah, okay. But but do you do you walk Rapid. Yes. every day? Um, or, or before Be before the okay. En estos días también. In these days. Sí. Wow, super nice, super nice. I admire you, boys. What about you, Isaac and Christian? Do you walk? Do you do exercise? Yes, after work I run in the park. Okay. When I when I come back at home. Wow, work. that's nice. And yes. Isaac, what about you? Do you do exercise? Hola, hola, hola. Hi, hi. Can you hear me? Me lo escuchar? Sí, sí, sí. Okay. Eh, you, la pregunta, repeat, please. Yes. Do you walk? Do you do exercise? Or do you go to the gym? Hello, hello. No puedo poner una foto. No. Es que creo que tiene un poquito de lagging. Creo que eh, por el internet lo escuché como un poquito más lento. Más, eh, lo escucha es después. Ajá, creo que tiene un poquito de lagging. So, eso le llamamos. Exercise. Ah, oh, yeah. There he is. Ajá, so you do exercise. Yes. Ok, ok. Nice, guys. I admire you completely. I admire that you do exercise, that you walk, that you run. Porque yo no hago nada. <laughs> I don't do anything. But you I need. Only, you only eat all no, day. No, I work all day. <laughs> really? Yeah. No, but I need to walk. So, voy a hacer lo mismo que hace Carolina. I'm going to, I'm going to walk fast. Yeah. Al menos First, 20 minutos. Slowly and then you can walk. I will try. Carolina, ¿cuánto tiempo? How long do you do you walk? Uh, 40, 40 minutes. Wow, that's a lot. <laughs> I will do the same, you know. I will do it. Uh, also, uh, dance, dancing. Oh. Zumba, zumba. zumba. Oh, I do that. I, no, no, no. I do, yeah. I do, uh, it's not insanity. Taibo. I do Taibo and, no. and Zumba, I don't like Zumba, but, but it's cool, but it's nice. No, you know, le recomiendo un programa. I recommend you one program, se llama Dance Workout. Ah. Se lo super recomiendo, Dance Workout. Ese es el nombre, creo que, creo que ese se llama. Dance Workout. I found it in YouTube. It's yes, super bueno, super, super good. I like it more than Zumba. But I nice. like it. It's nice. I like dancing. I cannot, but I like it. And Sandra, what about you? ¿Cuánto tiempo, eh, do, how long do you go to the gym? What, um, uh, two, two hours? What? Two or three hours? Every day? Every day. What? My goodness. <laughs> awesome, awesome girls. I like it. Es bien importante, right? Especialmente ahora que, que uno está encerrado. So super, yes. super nice. I'm sorry. That was the commercial. Los dejo trabajar. <laughs> Let me go and, and check the other groups. That, that was super good, guys. That was nice. 
Thanks. You're welcome. Bye. Um... Okay. Francisco, you next? Yeah. Okay. Let me talk about my daughter. Uh, your name is Monserrat. She is uh, three years old. And she, she wake up early. And she, she check your cell phone. And for for watch video, um, then she she have a breakfast, and okay. she plays she plays ball in the garden, and she doesn't. ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo puedo poner? No hace caso. No, she doesn't. Eh, she doesn't homework. You can, you can say she's not obedient. Obedient. Or, yeah, hi, or hi, hi. I'm sorry, hi. I was just listening. Hay una palabra que se llama behave. Entonces se puede decir she doesn't. Se lo escribo en el chat. Creo que tienen acceso ahorita. So, she doesn't behave. Este behave es de comportarse, como ella no se porta bien. So, she doesn't behave. Es, behave. ¿Es separado o es junto? Oh, okay. Behave es una palabra. No sé si separado. logra ver el chat. I don't know if you can see. Oh, okay. sorry. Sí, ya lo vi. Sí. Teo doesn't. Oh, sorry, se me fue una N además. But yeah, doesn't behave. Ese behave es como cuando usted le dice, bye, 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 see you. Usted le puede decir a alguien, hey, behave. Es como comportate, right? Portate bien. So, that's the word, behave. Mm -hmm. okay. Entonces, she doesn't behave. And my daughter doesn't go to bed early. That's it. Okay, very nice. Thank you, Francisco. That was good. Very good pronunciation. Very good order. Muy buena organización de las palabras. Solo no se nos olvide, please, que como estoy hablando de ella, vamos a utilizar también posesivos de ella. Entonces sería, like, su nombre, her name, her name. What is your daughter's name? Montserrat. Oh, okay. So her name is Montserrat. So para, como para su, right? Eh, lo demás, super bien. Very nice job. That's good, 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 good. Ok. Ok. Hey. Karen. Bueno, let me talk about uh, my mother. Her name is Sonia. She is housewife. My mother, uh, my mother uh, get up at 7 o'clock. She uh, she works in the morning every day uh, and prepare breakfast uh, every day. Her cooks very very good. He, and my mother makes a uh, cake. She listen and watching TV half day. Finish. Nice. Thank you. Yes, Karen. That was super good. Nice description of your mother. So your mother today. My, my turn. Okay. Go her son. Uh, let me talk about my brother. Uh, he's his name is Brandon. Uh, Brandon get up uh, eight o'clock, and Nats uh, get he get he gets uh, he he gets dressed, 
and that's he runs on the on the street and uh, Nets, uh, he take a shower and after that uh, he eats a uh, cereal and a bread or beans, eggs, uh, everything. <laughs> and uh, then he watched TV and finally in the morning, uh, he drives his car, his car, and go to work. It's okay, teacher. Oh, yeah, no. that, yeah, <laughs> no, yes, yes, you're doing, you're doing a very nice job. Yes, that's totally fine. Very good, very good, eh, Herson. Very good use of third person. También los utilizo correctamente. Yeah, that was super good. That was nice, nice, very good job. Francisco ya pasó también. Are we done? Ya terminamos. Are you finished here? Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay. Super good. Yes. Entonces regresamos. So let's go back to the main session. Excellent job, everybody. That was nice. Thank you. Nice. Teacher, you sing. Sorry, I was talking. <laughs> Sorry, I was in mute. Okay. Okay, everybody. So thank you so much for coming back. All right. We are going to we are going to have some volunteers. Okay, so we are going to listen to some of your classmates. Okay talking about this English. just give me a second and uh, let me see oh no i will not have volunteers today i'm going to have victims also <laughs> okay so i'm going to show you my roulette Okay, I'm going to select some volunteers victims. Okay, yo so me iba a pura poner, pero way. si es con la con si es con la ruleta rusa, okay. dale ahí mejor. Yeah, okay, okay, thank you, thank you. No, pero igual, vamos a escuchar, no se preocupe, ya va, ya va a salir. So yesterday no salió, but today you will. <laughs> okay, let's take a look. Uh, Gabriela. <laughs> You know, no, it's so so much. Fin, la traición, la traición, hermano. Así es, la hemos descubierto, Tito. Ella, ella, you know? ella, ella sabe dónde parar la ruleta. No, uh, sabe que azar es peluda. peluda. <laughs> Es que ese comentario no ya va a salir. No, si usted, ojalá usted la salga tenía usted, en le digo. Ojalá, ah, ojalá salga usted, le digo. ¿De qué soy? Ay, pero ahora sí. Believe me, en serio. It's, de, esta cosita es como random, no es manipulable. So I'm like, really? Ahorita que voy a comprar un lotín, tal vez. Oh, yeah. Y el, el destino, imagínense. Ok, Gaby, se lo escuchamos. El destino, dice lo Ya quería que, que participara. Ok. Go, go, Gaby, go, go, go. Bye. We can listen to you. Let me talk about the daily routine of my mom. Uh, she gets up early at 6 a.m. Then she takes a shower. After that, she takes her breakfast. And then she waters her, her garden. And later at 9 a.m., she starts, starts to work. And around 12 p.m., she comes home to take her lunch. After that, she prepares the product of her business uh, for um, 
makes the delivery route and then she turns home to take her dinner, no, takes her dinner and finally she goes to the bed. And Super! Oh, oh, okay. No, 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 solo eso, solo that's eso. That's it. Sol yeah! <laughs> Gabby, super good! Solo, solo, okay. tengo un, solo tengo un tema con she, she waters her, her garden. La verdad me lo inventé, yo no sé si se dice así. No, pero, pero sí, that's correct. Regar, como regar las plantas. Yeah, that's correct, you got it. She waters the plants or she waters the garden. No, super bien, Gaby. Super good, nice, good grammar, good vocabulary, good pronunciation, good fluency, yes, yes girl, super nice y job. también otra cosa, cuando digo como, por ejemplo, eh, after that she prepares the product of her business, o, o, o sería como the product, products of the business. Ambas están bien. You can say, she prepares the products of her business, para ser bien específico de su negocio, or she prepares the products of the business, como de una forma bien generalizada. Ambos están bien. Todo depende oh. de qué es lo que usted quiera decir, right? Oh, so, okay. both are good. Solamente lo escuché por ahí, creo que of uh, makes. No estoy segura. Ah, también, she, eh, no, después de business, to make the delivery, pero no sabía si era to makes the delivery. O solo eh, hacer, el eh, hacer el delivery. Sí, solamente eso quizás es la única cuestioncita. Quitémosle la S, to make, sin la S. Lo demás, perfecto. That was super, super nice. So, thank you. Very good job, guys. Give some emojis to Gaby. Good. No tenemos aplausos, but, but some emojis work, you know. So, give emojis. Come on. Yo creo, right. que, yo creo que ahorita va a salir como Gerson o no sé, entonces, por si querés participar de hey, eso, no. tal vez salís ahí, no sé. Guys, no, 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 no diga casualidad no, no, no. que va a salir. Oh, Billy, yo creo que, hay, yo creo que usted va a salir, ¿ves? Believe me, no hay mano peluda, así que... O oh, que salga Isela. La Isela, ah, cabrón. Y no. no se... peluda, pero saliste, Gerson. <risa> if I say Karen is next, you know, no es porque no, yo que... la seleccione. I mean, it's, it's, ya es el destino. Que salga, que salga Milagro. <risa> let's, let's check, let's take a look. Silvia, all right, you see, no, no hay mano peluda. So, Silvia, you're next, you're next. Silvia, are you here? Uh, okay. Sí, yeah, 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 there she is, okay. Let me talk about my brother. He rides a bicycle, later he eats breakfast, he doesn't wash dishes and he watches TV. Then he plays video games. He doesn't watch watch series. And then he takes a shower and that's it. Awesome, very good job. Nice, Silvia, that was good. Me gusta que le incluyó negativos también y muy buen uso de negativos. So good, that was super, super good. Thank you so much for your participation. Uh, thank you, Madeline, for the emoji. That's super good. Yeah, guys, give some emojis, you know. Nice, nice, nice. Next one, next is going to be, let's take a look. Next is going to be Doris. Doris, you are the one. You are the selected one. Okay. There you are. Okay. Let me talk about my brother. My brother's name is Kevin. He gets up at 5 a.m. Then he takes a shower very quickly because he goes to the work at 6 a.m. He works in a school as math teacher and he plays soccer with my cousins 
he cooks seals food because also he has a company of the, the and he prepare ceviches and cocktails. That's all. Thank you. Nice. Excellent description. And thank you also for the marketing. <laughs> super, no, no, don't say cocktails, come on. All right, that was super good, that is nice. Very good, just a vocabulary. Excuse me? Tu manager. Ah, yeah. manager. Oh, no, pues sí, let's make business, okay? Very nice, very nice. And my last big team, uh, my last volunteer of the night for this is going to be... Milagros, Maria Milagros. Eso. You are the one, you are the one. You're the Eso. one. Eso quería Eso. So let's listen to you. Let's listen. Yo le dije a la teacher que pusiera a, a, a Milagro. No, no, ya vio que no hay mano, no hay trampa. Están haciendo Estamos muy mala fama. Puede. You can do it, Milagro. Let's listen Qué to you. Qué bárbaro. Let me de todo lo que tiene. <laughs> Let me talk about my husband. Your name is Mauricio. Gets up and exercise, then takes a bath and eats his breakfast. He gets ready to go work. He works in his business and he really likes his job. Come home late and tired. At night, he likes to watch TV. He does not fall asleep early. That's it. Hey, super good. Thank you. That was really nice, my letter. Thank you. Thank you. Gracias. Very good description. <laughs> Very good description. <laughs> it almost everybody. No, that was good. Very good. You know, very good pronunciation. So I understood. Le logré entender, like, cada pedacito de información que nos dio su esposo. Super nice. Eh, I understood that your husband likes his job y me gustó que agregó vocabulario en agua. So, Súper bien. Very nice, very nice. Ya ven, milagros. You can do it, you can do it, girl. That was super good. Ok, Los, compañ los compañeros me han ayudado. Nice. Allí. Puedes intimidar por Gerson. Sí. <laughs> no, de eso se trata, chicos, de ayudarnos, de colaborarnos, right? So that is the point. Ok, everybody, terminamos con esto. We are going to finish with this exercise. Es súper cortito. And it says here, simple present, yes, no questions. Create four questions with the auxiliary provided. Ya tenemos ahí el does, do, do, and does. Lo único que vamos a hacer es completarle con lo que hace falta. Puede ser cualquier pregunta. Um, dice K4, tenemos un par de minutitos, all right. So, con dos que escribamos está súper bien. Solo para que nos recordemos del boca, de la estructura, right que es uh, lo que vamos a, uh, lo que nos van a evaluar en el parcial, en el examen que tienen. All right, so write two questions, escojan una con das y una con do, y las revisamos ahorita. So we check it. Si tienen alguna duda todavía como de cómo utilizar los auxiliares, es el momento también para que lo revisamos, right? So yo, 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 no, yo no sé con el das, con el do sí es como, puede ser como, do you want to eat, do you want to go to a, do you want to go run, creo que es, uh -huh. pero con el das, no sé. Ah, ok, ok, ok. Y la primera pregunta que me dijo fue con do you? No, con, que no tengo problemas con el do, con el do, como por ejemplo, do you want to eat? Ah, ok, Ve, hagamos uh -huh. lo siguiente. De la um, rutina que me dijo de su mamá, díganme una oración de las que tiene. Eh, va. Eh, she, take, she takes her breakfast. Okay, that's a good one. So, she takes her breakfast. Ahora, yo, yo le quiero hacer la pregunta a usted de si desayuna temprano, por ejemplo. So, la pregunta ya no sería, do you? Porque no quiero saber sobre usted, quiero saber de su mamá. Entonces, como es ella, como es tercera persona, es cuando yo utilizo el das para he, she, and it. Entonces, primero yo comienzo con el das. Ya está dado. 
Luego necesito saber de quién estamos hablando. Sería your mother. Does your mother. Entonces, vamos primero. Does. Does. Ok. Luego vamos con el sujeto. ¿De quién hablo? Does your mother. No. Does your husband. Does your brother. Does your niece. Does your y cualquier mom. persona, right? O puedo decir el nombre. Does Milagro. Does her son. Does eh, Francisco. Does eh, Vero. Das edit, ok, puedo decir el nombre de la persona y luego necesito la actividad. So, das. dice say breakfast. Sí. Uh -huh. ¿Cómo la armaríamos? Das. Das. She. Das. Das, she. Your, das your father is tall? Mm, no, milagros. Is tall no porque tenemos el verbo is. So, es un verbo que no lo mezclamos con el das. Acá necesito otro, cualquier otro verbo, excepto el verbo vi. El verbo vi ya no lo puedo utilizar, ¿no? Oh, does, uh -huh. does your mother eat? Does the mother eat? Ah, solo es como tu mamá come. Exacto, oh. exacto. Pero entonces es como en primera persona, que siempre el das va primero, como uh -huh. el hacer, como is she angry, que el is, que se, como, que se eh, da vuelta. Um, no, sí, sí le entiendo, entiendo su pregunta, pero no exactamente, ¿sí? Because no es el mismo verbo, ¿sí? Entonces, primero tenemos does o tenemos do, right? Depende. Then, we are going to have un sujeto, siempre necesito un sujeto, nunca puedo ir solito. Does, subject, all right? Luego necesito un verbo. Algo que veíamos ayer era que el verbo ya no cambia. Do you remember this part? Nunca cambió el verbo, right? And then we need complement. Entonces, yes, esa es la estructura de una pregunta. Lo único que hacemos entonces es ir rellenando. So, a mí me sirve bastante irlo haciendo así, you know, lineal. Das, y, y luego un verbo, dance. Y eso es todo. Does she dance? Does she dance? Quiero ser más específica y le pregunto a su mamá. Does your mother dance? Dance. Hey, Gabriela, does your mother dance? Yeah, puede ser, yes, she do. Uh, no, porque ¿cuál fue el auxiliar que utilizó? Ah, no, yes, she dance. Ok, puedo utilizar yes, she dances, or este mismo auxiliar. Yes, she, she does. Exacto, yes, she does. Ah, so, so, yes, she does. O si fuera negativo, no. In, she doesn't. Okay. Exactly, exactly. So, pretty oh, much. Yeah. No, she doesn't. Okay. Y acá, this is it. All right. So, a mí me sirve bastante hacerlo en orden, right? Does, subject, and verb. Siguiendo does. eso. Does. Your Pero cuando mother. se utiliza el nombre, entonces, teacher, solo sería does. De depende, it really depends. Uh -huh. Si tenemos un nombre, por uh -huh. ejemplo, cambiamos esto, all right? Let's change this one. Y voy a utilizar acá, I'm going to use um, Yasira, for example. Does uh -huh. Yasira dance? Hey, does uh -huh. Yasira dance? All right. So, esto no, no me cambia. Lo único que uh -huh. hace el she es tomar el lugar del nombre. Por eso se le uh, llaman pronombres. Yasira uh -huh. does. Does Yasira does, yes, does. Does Yasira. Yes. Does Yasira. Yes. Por ejemplo, yo he escrito, eh, does Aida clean the houses. Yeah, very good. Exactly. Does Aida clean the house? Uh -huh. Does Yasira study? Does Francisco play the guitar? Él dijo que no. Or is, uh, does, primero does, auxiliar, luego subject, y de último el verbo. All right? We finish with this part. Vamos a seguirlo practicando. Y, teacher, y para aquí, esta respuesta, este, para hacer la afirmativa sería yes, Aida das. Yeah, that's a possibility. Yes, Aida das. O solamente, yes, uh, she does. Ah, uh -huh. uh, ok. Right. Eh, escuché por ahí una voz. Sí, yo. Milagro, tell me. Sí. Eh, por ejemplo, yo he puesto 
Does your father go? Mm -hmm. Very good. Correcta. Yes. yes Ahora, si correct. es positiva, sería yes, he. Yes, he. Como es your father, no sería she, sino que yes, he does. Mm -hmm. Does. Exactly. Is, y, y, y en negativo, no, no, he doesn't. Exactly. Solo es este el cambio, right? No, he doesn't. Mm -hmm. Very good. Teacher, y para, por ejemplo, para saber de, de los exámenes, ¿cómo vamos a saber? ¿De cuál examen, perdón? De, de, lo, de la evaluación que se iba a hacer para ahora, lo más tarde mañana. A las ah, eh, Yacir, su evaluación ya está, ya está posteada. Al, eh, ah, ok. Le, le voy a Son diferentes para, las eh, para todos, o es el mismo. Mm, I'm not quite sure. No me recuerdo. I, I, I don't Yo creo que es diferente. Mm, I don't think so, pero son varias partes. So, hey guys. So, 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 vamos a seguir practicando esto la próxima semana, así que no se me preocupen, no worries, porque ese es un tema un poco extenso. Eh, tell me, Silvia. Me, Silvia. Este, eran cinco partes o cuatro partes. A ahorita le confirmo. Right now, a mí me salieron cuatro, Silvia. Uh, no. Oh, never mind. Yeah, it's four. It's four. Four parts. Okay. Okay. Chicos, ¿quiénes ya me terminaron el examen? Who finished the exam? Eh, Yo, un emoji, me. please. Send me an emoji. Así puedo, puedo ver qué me hace falta. I can see, like, who is done. Yo solo le debo una tarea, teacher. Ah, bye. Yo no lo he hecho, teacher. Ahora lo voy a hacer. Yo no lo he hecho. Lo voy a hacer el fin de semana. No se puede. No, el día tiene que subir las notas mañana. Ay, no. Pero está, antes de, está antes está de las 10. Antes de las 10. Está corto, Gaby, hacerlo. Está, está cortito. Está, está cortito, bien. Está fácil. Gaby. Está fácil también. Denos copia, denos copia. Denos no, copia. tampoco se den copia. No. No, no, no sean, no sean exagerados. Gaby, Gaby, si usted ha hecho buena conversación ahora, puede mucho. Es cierto, that's true. All right. Todavía veo que me yeah. faltan un par, chicos. Eh, please, eh, si pueden ahorita, no les va a tomar, ¿cuánto les tomó? 15 minutos, 15 minutes. Menos. Menos. Cinco minutos. Yo lo hice por dos partes. No lo sé, Rick. Vaya, Gaby, cinco minutos de ese. Que Así todos que... ellos son expertos. Nosotros sí, minutos. nosotros no, no, no. no. Yo las, no exper las expertas se han quedado. Más Gerson. <risa> ah, Gerson. A mí eso realmente sí me llevó más tiempo. Christian. Pero, pero ya lo terminó. Madre, Madre. La... Maña, ya lo terminé. Ma mañana a las nueve, cincuenta. Me, no, me puse a completar todas las conversaciones desde las 6 de la tarde. Voy a hacer refuerzo ah, yo super ahí. Nice, tengo ah, el más Apareció Cristian. Estaba mudo. Claro, buenas noches, milagro. ¿Cómo es? ¿Qué le pasó? Que ahora no ha aparecido, hijo. Después de dos ver, horas, yo no. Yo estoy. Después de dos horas apareció. Bye, chicos, <ríe> chicos sí, les agradecería enormemente hasta las 10 de la mañana de sábado, right? mañana 10 de la mañana máximo, porque así a las 10 en puntito yo les subo las notas y hago el reporte right? de, de, de cómo vamos hasta el momento. Remember que tenemos una nota mínima de 8, yo espero que, estoy segura que les va a ir súper bien, aparte que ya vi por sí. ahí algunos. Y, y sí, tienen 100%. Así que, you can do it, you can do it, guys. Sí, teacher, tengo Dígame. una pregunta con respecto a eso. Eh, en los exámenes, igual que en las tareas, se puede... Everybody, thank you so much. Ha sido una semana muy productiva. Estoy muy feliz con los resultados. Estamos hablando bastante. That was awesome. Me hace sentir muy, muy feliz, everybody. So, sigamos. Nos vemos la próxima semana. And have a nice weekend. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.